Hi, this is Deb Chambers, Vice President of Development and Partnerships at Central Union Mission, and today I'm so excited to be six feet apart <laughs> from Ben, <laughs> the pastor at Passion City Church. Well, it's great to be here with you, Deb. Thanks, yeah. Ben. Thanks for spending some time with us. We're here with them at um, RFK's parking lot because Convoy of Hope has come to Central Union Mission. It's all because of Passion City and their relationship and their care for people in need in our city. So yeah. share with us a little bit about what you guys are doing today. Well, it's crazy. You know, I mean, we, we feel like, you know, we're citizens of the city. So if one part suffers, we all suffer. And so how can we help the city? We had a relationship with Convoy. So they rolled in deep with 30,000 pounds of food. And, you know, for us, we're always, who's doing a great job of serving the city? How can we serve you? And we've been friends with you guys a long time. So it was an easy decision to say, can this help? Can we help you help people? Let's go. And it's turned out being a pretty beautiful day. So we're pretty excited about it. <laughs> yeah, it was pouring down rain this morning, but yeah, God made stop. a way. And now we've got <laughs> sunshine. And we were just able to load 3,000 pounds of food. Crazy that we're gonna use at our Family Ministry Center. For those of you that don't know, uh, Central Union Mission operates a Family Ministry Center and we serve between 3,000 to 4,000 people every month. These are Amazing. people that are living at or below the poverty level. And so this epidemic, this crisis has hit them harder than others because yeah. they tend to be Hispanic and African American and they're in service industries. Yeah. And so those are the folks, first folk to lose their jobs. So yeah. this really helps to feed more people than you you could imagine yeah well we're honored to be a part of it again we we've, we've just been so impressed by you and central union and the way we can serve alongside of you is a gift to us so we're grateful and thank you for what you're doing for our city well oh my gosh thank you <laughs> you know central union mission we're privately funded we don't receive government funding because we are faith-based and we want to be free to operate in our faith you know uh -huh. we don't compel people to have faith to receive services, yep. but we want to operate in a Christian and a godly manner and be able to teach and offer Bible study and programming that's Christ-centered and Christ-focused because ultimately that's our goal to glorify God. 100%. And so, you know, when we were originally founded, we were founded as the mission of the churches. Yep. And churches, we can't do it without you. So yeah. just a huge thanks from me and from the, all the folks that are gonna get this food yeah. and just know that it makes such a blessing. Well, we love it, we love it. <laughs> Anytime, and we're just grateful to see what God's gonna do with this and in the years ahead, how we can keep serving the city together. Amen, so, Yeah. amen. Well, that's the name of this segment. It's Mission Possible, and it's only possible because of people like Ben and the congregants at Passion City Church. Thank you guys for making the mission possible. Bye.